Hi guys, in this video tutorial I'll be showing you how you can control your jailbroken iPod with your computer and that means that you can screen record it too if you want to make a screencast of various apps on your iPod. Now I'm going to start out by showing you the software that you need to have installed on your computer. To get that you need to go to realvnc.com, go to the products tab and click the free edition. That should bring you to a tab that looks like this. You just want to download the latest version and install it. Somewhere in the installation there should be a few check marks asking you whether you want to install the server or the viewer. You just want to make sure that you install the viewer. So I'm going to pause the video here and head over to my iPod to show you what software you need to get from there. So once you're on your iPod Touch or iPhone you need to open up Cydia then go down to the search tab at the bottom right. This is one of my gripes about Cydia. It takes forever to load but other than that the whole jailbreaking process is great. You get to install custom themes and all. So now we can click the search button and search for a package named VNC. That's V E E N C Y. It should be the first one. And at the top right of a button that says modify for you, it will say install because I already have this on here. So that's all you need to do to install stuff on or install VNC. So now you need to go to the settings button. It should open eventually. Uh, the first one should be Wi-Fi. You need to click on that. And where, it's, uh, where it shows your network name, you need to press the blue arrow. And you need to look at the IP address, the very first one. You need to remember that number because that's what we'll be using to connect to your iPod. So if I go back... Now I'm going to go on the computer and start up our VNC viewer. You need to go to start all programs and I don't know wherever it installed to. It shouldn't be that hard to find. And where it says VNC server, you need to enter that IP address that we just showed you. For me it's 192.168.1.77. Encryption, set it to let VNC server choose. So I'm going to click connect now and on my iPod you'll see that this popped up. You can click accept and now a whole new window popped up so now I have two, I only need one, but that shows you the process. Now from here you can screen record this like I'm doing so that's pretty much it. If you don't know how to jailbreak your iPod or if it's not jailbroken you can just search on YouTube, there's tons of tutorials. So thanks for watching this video, if you liked it please comment, rate, and subscribe.